Hello everyone and welcome back to Farming Simulator 22. We continue on No Man's Land. Uh, we have the sale for April. This is all the stuff that we have. Also a bathtub. New product that we uh, are making now. Can be sold. The cloth could be a little bit better. If I'm not mistaken on the... Uh, the other sell point. But at the fabric... Yeah, but it's only 26. No, yeah, 21 and 5, 26. So I'm not going to move that around. That's a little bit too much for those four. It's only 100, uh, 100 bucks. So let's see what we uh, get out of this. A lot of pepper grinders. I think we're making a decent amount of money here. There we go, that's it. 237 plus 17, that makes 40, 255,000. That's nice. Not that much. And we have a lot of work to do uh, this month. Need to uh, cultivate a lot of fields because we need to sow. I've. Uh, in between episodes I uh, created a few more fields over there. I also uh, got the oil seed radish in and all the fields that were uh, left. I think this is... Wait, didn't I do this one? Apparently not. Unless uh, there's something in here. There should be potatoes and sugar beets in this field. Let me check. Not mistaken. No, that's this one. Okay, missed, uh, missed this field. Uh, not too bad, but I could have done this. Uh, done this one. This one, this one, and this one. This one was already done. But I seem that I forgot these two here. That's not the end of the world. At least, unless we don't have to seed yet. But I think we need to. Let's have a look. We need to seed the corn. The soybeans. That's the big fields. Uh, then we have the sorghum that's not a big field don't we have oh yeah this stuff here red beets carrots and parsnip and we could also do the popular so that means uh, basically as follows we have here the, uh, the sorghum the uh, corn, the what was the, uh, what was the other one? Uh, soybeans, the carrots, parsnips, the popular, and the third uh, what is uh, red beets? Not sugar beet, but the red beets. So we have a lot of work to do uh, because these fields need to be taken care of. So these are empty now. Okay, then we can drive easily through them. That's not a problem. So let's do that. And then I'm going to set uh, at least already one tractor in motion to cultivate the field. And we need to check for a cedar. Now yeah, we could do with a second uh, cultivator, I think. That would not be a bad idea, because we have a lot of things to seed, a lot of things to cultivate, and we have uh, different uh, seeders, but only one cultivator. I mean, the sorghum, the soybeans can be done with the planter. The corn also, but the sorghum can be done with the seeder, so... And the popular is a completely different story. Oh, I need uh, for that this... Uh, this thing, yeah. Okay, well, popular isn't that important for now. So let's have a, a quick look. Uh, don't need you. You could do... Yeah, okay. You don't have anything connect. Okay, you pick up the cultivator that's facing the other way. We need to go along here. Uh, 
That's this fella. But that's a very expensive machine. So if we need to buy another one. It's going to cost us uh, dearly. I could also go for the uh, cornfield first. Let's pick up this one here close by. Uh, this is one of the other fields, but this is needed yet. We have two small fields before this one uh, needs to be done. So let's position you here. Create a job. Yeah, that's the big field. Good. Uh, two. Headlands clockwise. Yeah, I think every... Uh, no, you... Let's see if we can do it longest edge. Let's see if that goes... Uh, yeah, that's properly. Okay. Sometimes it goes on an angle, but these fields are square, so that shouldn't be a problem. Let's line you up a little bit better. Also unfold you. So we have the potatoes and the sugar beets then over there. And behind that there's the, the cotton. Okay, that's looking good at least. Uh, not very well lined up again. Okay, let's try it again. I know that course play does it by itself. But usually it's not the real best uh, thing. I prefer to do it exactly. Almost exactly. Something like this. That should be fine. First waypoints. You can start cultivating. Yeah, and I th we could rent another cultivator. We don't, although we ha have this every year, so maybe we should buy another cultivator. Yeah, I think that's the, the best uh, th course of action. Let's see what's uh, on, on sale. Uh, not very interesting. So, uh, it was a disc harrower, if I'm not mistaken. 12 meters. This one, the Joker. I think so. Disc harrow. Oh, we can also use it to seed. Hmm. That's odd. I don't. No, we don't have this 8.2 meters. We have a bigger one. We have this one. Yeah, this can't be used to seed. Yeah, let's buy another one. Uh, details. Because we have so much fields to do. Buy. There we go. And we probably want to have um, uh, seeding stuff for our parsnip and uh, uh, red beets and that kind of stuff. That is, where is it? Seeders planters. I think I'm missing something here. Forest bladers. Forestry equipment, no. Wait, isn't there a category? Uh, oh, vegetable technology, there it is. Uh, I think we have a six meter wide. Yeah, that's for these three. And it also, uh, it doesn't give us fertilizer. We have to keep an eye for that. Okay, let's see what we have. Nothing special here. Uh, let's pick up one. So buy. I think we could do with a small tractor. This one doesn't only does only need 70 horsepower. So if we could do that. So small tractor. Where have we have it? Uh, here the class. Let's bring you. There we go. Not the twin wheels, narrow wheels, no, wide wheels with weights. Front loader attachment, no, we don't need that. Uh, we want to have this one, yeah, that's for sure. So this one can do 200 horsepower, gonna cost us 268,000, so fine with me. Uh, anything else that we need, I don't 
think so. We don't need to roll this stuff. That's not necessary. But we do need to uh, somehow get that stuff here. This one I can take with me. But the big one, uh, yeah. I, I, or can I lift it up on the front? Maybe I can. If it's not too heavy, I can bring both uh, in one go to the farm. That would be nice. If you could lift this up. Yeah, I think you can. Yep, okay, that's good. Counteracts a little bit the heavy uh, disc carrier, which this one can't uh, use, of course. But we can bring it to far. That's not a problem. And then we still have to uh, buy some popular. But that can be done later on. I don't think we can do everything in one uh, episode today. Well, like I say, uh, see you at the farm, but we're almost there. It's not <laughs> that far anymore these days. The farm is so big. Let's simply continue uh, without a cut. That might be better. And then the other tractor can go do the sorghum. And then in the meantime, this one can do, uh, when it's finished, it can seed uh, some corn or some soybeans. It doesn't matter too much. I think the best is to do corn, to be honest. I'm not sure which one is quicker or faster, but... Uh, the grass probably next month again. So I think we leave the disc harrow around here. That is good enough. We should also check uh, for the animals. How are they doing on the uh, 5.7? 5, oh, try it again. 4.7. That's fair enough. 3. 2.9. That's still good enough for now, but we get at the point that we... Oh, let's uh, do that. Yeah, we need to fill you. Let's do that. That first, uh, in, in theory, this uh, tractor should take the same amount of time as the big ones when it comes to seeding, because this is only a six meter. Oh, come on. Really? Do I have to go all the way around here and then back again to attach you? You can't do it on an angle. Seriously. There we go. I don't think they will fit in that much, but I think that we don't need it much to uh, to seed, to be honest. So let's see how much uh, fits in here. Three, 32 liters only? Wow. Okay. Well, uh, we'll see about that. That's not much. I mean... We, we start with the red beet, why not? But this is really... Uh, 32 liters. Well, they're very small seeds, so probably the fits uh, maybe hundreds uh, of those seeds in a liter. That's probably it. I know soybeans are pretty big. And corn also. And I think these seeds are way smaller than the... Um, for example, also the, the wheat and then the barley and that kind of stuff. So, yeah. Uh, let's see. Let's turn on crop sensor. Not sure if it works with these crops or not. Oh, not available for red beet. So, that's not needed. Okay. Fair enough. Uh, let's create a job for you. Yeah, that's the field. Good. Uh, let's make four headlands, I think. It's a little bit bigger. Although it doesn't need much uh, room to... Uh, automatic. Uh, let's say longest edges. That should go. Yeah, okay. There we go. Looking good. Let's turn you into blue. 
first waypoint. Uh, let's see how that looks. Uh, oh, that's the same as uh, the sugar beet and that kind of stuff. Yeah. Okay. Too bad that that stuff doesn't fit in the same plant, huh? because it's the same texture, but... Well, you... Uh, oh, you already had one liter gone. Wow. Okay. So, we need to refill a couple of times. Not sure why there is so less stuff. Is, is the, no, there was not an expansion uh, available to get some more liters in there. And I don't think that any of the other ones were uh, bigger. They were smaller, I think. Uh, no, not you. Uh, need to use here. Vegetable technology. Uh, this tool creates ridges into which you can plant your vegetables afterwards. Yeah, we don't do that. We simply pick, look at this. is only 3 meters and has 16 liters. I mean... Doesn't say. Oh, that's uh, harvesting. Yeah. So, no, there is not really anything else that you can do. Maybe there are some mods uh, which has a higher capacity. But this is going... Uh, well, quick is maybe exaggerating, but we're already down 20%. But that piece, so... Yeah. Ooh. Okay. Well, that's a lot of uh, riding to do then. That's for sure. Uh, we need the other big one. Where are you? There you are. You can pick up the... Uh... The other disc harrower and do the soy... Not the soybean, the sorghum field. Uh, you might need a little bit of uh, fuel. Yeah, let's do that. Almost full. There we go. 562 euros. Uh, very well. Uh, let me see. Which field was it? Behind the cotton field. So I need yeah, to go through here. Let's make a turn. start at this point now oh, we don't have to start exactly in the in the corner we can go a little bit further on that might be even a little bit better so let's make a course for you create a job mm, manual let's pick also longest that should do it 12.2 uh, yeah that's good there we go well, and that's what I mean. Look at that. It's a little bit on an angle somehow. I'm not sure why it does it. So let's... Uh, let's uh, put that a little bit different then. Do it on manual and set it on zero. That should make it straight. There we go. I'm not sure why. I mean, the, the field is nice and straight. Uh, it's square. And somehow it wants to... Uh, do it on a little bit of an angle. Maybe because there's some, some bump in there or something like that. Could be. Not 100% sure. So you can go. There we go. All the oil seed radish is now being uh, plowed under. Let's have a quick look at our uh, little one over here. Oh, you already did... One round, okay. Oh, that's more than I expected, to be honest. Maybe I misjudged. Uh, 
or no that's south so this is the second headland that you're doing okay well we uh, stay a little bit with this um, like I said I don't uh, have the ridges I don't think it really helps it's a lot of extra work you should be on okay you're not on sharp let's stop you and because that was not the intention to be honest you're missing all kinds of pots now let's do that quickly get rid of you uh, you probably missed also something here yeah already can see it let's go straight there we go then we have another one then we have to redo this and then set it on uh, sharp instead of uh, well I'm not sure what it is uh, set at the moment there we go as you can see that's uh, the potatoes down there and the sugar beets down here I think if I'm not mistaken we're gonna set set it from the same point uh, you already missed a little bit here also let's uh, let's make sure that it's filled in there we go okay let's uh, see if we can get course play up again temporary course uh, smooth yeah okay we don't need smooth we don't we need sharp there we go generate there we go and now we can go to the nearest waypoint because it was already on its way this shouldn't change i think you were already trying to make a point here let's uh, start from here why not see what it does now there we go yeah you're picking in a little bit there that's good now you turn around and then do the rest you're one third left so you're basically one and a quarter so one and a half rounds although the rounds get smaller and smaller of course hmm. We could do with some bags perhaps so that we don't have to drive all every time. Uh, yeah, let's do that. Let's, uh, let me see. We have you. Disconnect you. Let's pick, no. That's connecting. That's not disconnecting. There we go. Let's see how much we have left. Uh, in the cedars we could do with a bag or two maybe you have still a thousand liters left okay let's see if i can there we go that's uh two bags uh i can turn you off let's go for our forklifter where are you there you are you should be able to pick those two up, aren't you? I mean, 31 liters, that's almost a full, uh, full cart uh, for the cedar. Let's see, I didn't think I can... Well, the small one is the 31 liters, that's for sure. So let's pick this one up first.
and we can bring that over there so that we don't have to go back and then we can put that thousand liter bag also down there so that we can uh, easily fill it again we only have to go to the bags and not all the way back it's only 32 liters I mean if we drive all the way back to uh, the refill point that's a little bit ridiculous I think this is a nice solution for it to pick it up on the truck of course but I wonder if we can uh, fill it while the the tractor is doing its job not sure I mean the tractor doesn't go that fast, we can do 25, the tractor doesn't do 25, so if we could uh, somehow lift that back on top of there, will it fill it? I don't think it does. Yeah it does, okay. For a moment I thought it wouldn't, but it does fill it. And there we go, 31 liters uh, gone, good. Let's pick up the other one. Oh, that's uh, one thing. So we can keep our uh, forklifter uh, close by and when we see, oh, it's all, almost getting empty, just drive behind it and it can continue. That's uh, a good thing. I haven't checked uh, the silage yet. I'm not sure how far it is. Let's have a look at that. There's so many things to do now at the farm. Eighty-eight percent. Okay, that's uh, probably in a few hours. It's ready. A thousand liters. So that means ten times three hundred. Uh, no, uh, yeah, two, thirty-two liters each time, basically. That means uh, 320 is 10 times, 960, that's 30 times. So we can refill the thing 30 times before we run out of, uh, of seats. I think that's a lot. This is pull back. A little bit too close. Uh, let's turn around here. Then we can pick up the fertilizer again, that's not a problem. But this we keep for our, uh, our beets. Uh, basically, yeah, carrots, beets and parsnips. Uh, a root crop, so to speak of. But we have to keep a close eye on that. So I assume that we get a decent amount of crops out of that field. I mean, why would you otherwise have such a small uh, capacity? Wouldn't be economical to, to do this. Uh, let's uh, drop you down for now. There we go. Turn you off. Uh, yeah, you can now pick up all the uh, fertilizer again. No, I don't have to start. Well, maybe I do have to start the engine. It's a little bit uh, awkward how step. Maybe I should uh, refill it. We need it later on. So, I could do that. Maybe also the other one. Not sure what we're going to do with this one. Probably uh, getting some lime in. Or we can fertilize, uh, of course, the, the root crops because they don't have fertilizer. But we can pick up the fertilizer spreader. There we go, 98%. Let's fill you up. Uh, with the rest of the stuff. 
Because this is going to be... This is going to be the sorghum. Let's already select that. Yeah, there we go. And then the other one is for the one, I guess. Yep. Let's uh, move along here. The pile of wood uh, that was besides the, the factory here, that's already all gone. All being uh, picked up. By the sawmill and the paper mill. Okay, so you're good to go. Now let's pick up the other one. And also this uh, tractor can also do uh, some rolling of uh, the fields. Sunflower, no, you're going to be... Corn, there we go. It's a little bit strange that you can do soybeans with this one and with the other one, with the planter and with the seeder. Makes it a little bit difficult to say, well, you need to roll it or you don't need to roll it. In general, it's planting is, rolling is not needed, seeding, rolling is needed, but not sure how that works out for the soybeans. I think that they are pretty big uh, eats to be honest so maybe in in real life uh, rolling isn't done with uh, with soybeans I'm not sure uh, that's been taken care of okay uh, I couldn't uh, fit all the iron in the factory you can have 40,000 liters and its capacity is around well, I had 44,000 liters to, to drop in there, but it can hold 40,000 liters, uh, 60,000, sorry. But it only uses 24 times 416. So that's around 10,000 liters a day. So we have way more iron ore than we can process at the moment. So maybe in the future we will do another one. I'm not sure, but not now at least. Uh, we leave the iron as is because we can't sell it... Uh, as a raw material as far as I can tell at least I don't think so never checked to be honest but I don't think we can sell we can sell metal but we can't sell iron oh yeah iron ore we can sell it for three thousand oh well let's do it. oh yeah well three thousand three thousand yeah that's look at that it's only 100 so we can sell the excess we have okay that's good to know because the factory can't handle everything. Oh, you're almost done. That's good. Let's uh, pick up the truck. Yeah, there's a little bit laying there, but that's not much. You're at 12 liters. That's still a third. Okay. Yeah, you I need. Let's bring that iron ore then uh, to the... To the shop can try to fill a little bit more but can I fit through here I'm afraid not no that's not can try it but let's not do that that might not be the best idea I've ever had There we go. Uh, still seven and a half thousand liters. Let's see if we can drop some here. Uh, we're only one hour in, so probably not much. No, look at that. It's only a few hundred liters here. 
it's probably uh, where we have it here probably 416 liters because we're just one hour in started at eight o'clock Now this is the wrong trailer for the poplar, but we can... I have no idea how much poplar we need to be honest to fill a field like this for the wood chips. But we'll see. Not gonna do it in this episode. Well this isn't too bad to be honest, but... Like I said, it, it would have been nicer if we had, let's say, 300 liters capacity on that thing. I think it would... Uh, do it in one go then but maybe you're not used to do this size of fields with it not sure I'm really uh, interested to see how much uh, we get out of it and we can make soup out of it and some other stuff I think so iron ore is not ex excuse me wait a minute Iron ore. Oh wait, the furnace to sell everything. Yeah, okay, twenty nine eighty two. So it's the other one. It's this one. Sell everything. I'm mistaken it for the farm shop, but that was not correct. This one will uh, take it. At least we can get rid of it. That's something. There we go. Oh look at that. That's uh, twenty two, twenty three thousand, and a bit. Oh, that's a lot. Good. At least we get uh, 10 times and we have a factory back. You are on the iron ore, not even on the metal. I think we might to refill uh, our beet seeder. I think I'm gonna call it a beet seeder, that's uh, the easiest thing. Let's call it a root seeder. Hmm. Let's uh, stop here for now. Oh, you're now going up and down. That's good. Uh, finished work. That's uh, okay. We already 37 minutes in, but maybe we can. Uh, now I shouldn't drive over the seeded field, of course, but uh, I guess we have to do what we need to do. I think it's filling it, yeah, but I also think it's already full, because it's so little what needs to get in there. Finished work, so you can pick up the uh, corn uh, thing. Uh, let's bring you home first, otherwise I might uh, be missing. We also need to... Uh, yeah, look at that, there's uh, wheat in there, so we need to uh, take care of that also. Which we can do with our other uh, tractor, that's still there. Just like I said, so many things to do at the moment. Disconnect you. Um yeah, you. Let's put you aside and pick up the cedar. Fuel is fine, nothing needing there. But the distances are getting bigger. We have, we have a pretty big farm at the moment, to be honest. And we are not done yet. We need a few more fields. We need another field for uh, the barley. I think we could do with another field with uh, canola uh, also. I think I've run out of... Let's have a look. Run out of some stuff here. 
Well, nothing red. Okay, well, the, the, the wheat is all gone. So we definitely need more wheat. We still seem to have canola and sunflowers. Okay. Uh, cake we never made because we don't have... Uh, oh, we could set the strawberries uh, temporarily to uh, distribute, to put it in here. And then the sugar we have soon. No, okay, we are... Uh, how are you doing? 53 liters of wool. Yeah, you have to split, but soon we get more uh, sheep and then that should be fine. Uh, let's see, we might uh, end up with a little bit of uh, a problem here. Not enough space, although we could fit another one down here. Just besides the baler. Yeah, that should be okay. Uh, now the question is which one of the two I can never uh, tell them apart if it's it this one that I need or is this the uh, sorghum uh, seeder no this is the corn this is the right one okay and I'm already going to put uh, the crop sensor on, there we go. I think we're gonna start a little bit inside the field, not uh, exactly on the corner. Let's go something like uh, like this. That should be good enough. Two headlands. Let's see what we can do here. Two headlands sharp. Uh, longest edge could be okay, maybe. Depends. Uh, no, look at it again. Again on an angle. So strange. Uh, so, that is not really... Let's see what it does when we say automatic. Okay, then it goes straight. Fair enough. I think this should do it. Ooh, you need a lot of uh, fertilizer. 145, okay. Well, we do have 7,000 liters in here, so it should be fine. And you are on your way, if you are going at least. Yep, there we go. That's the corn being seeded. Good. You're still working. That's not going to happen uh, in this episode. Good. You have 16, so you're halfway with your uh, stuff again. Uh, you're getting there. Okay. And this one. Yeah, you need to pick up the sprayer. Because we need to do some weed control. I think there's still fertilizer in there, to be honest, but... Or is it empty? No, that's the wheat. Uh, okay, that's uh, the herbe herbicide. So let's go a little bit back, see if we can drop it here. Yep. And pick this one up. How much do we have left here? I think that's plenty for the field. Yeah, 1200 liters should be more than enough for that field. Let's have a quick look uh, how everything is going. Uh, this one I need. Okay, we have two fields. This one and this one. Aha. Needs rolling. Well, yes. No. 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 Yes. No. No. Okay. And this one. Oh, that's the sunflowers. No. So, yeah. Okay. Let's let's turn that off. Plowing can be turned off. 
we need to we two fields so i'm going to start this one and then call it an episode and then probably some later in i'll be back with you uh, to continue with all the work that's going on here so let's go to the sunflowers first or is the other one closer by uh i think that's closer by to be honest and after the harvest uh, we're going to make uh, field 27 also squared we're gonna pick uh, we're gonna make the pond a little bit smaller over here going on all the way to there then we can uh, go also behind uh, the furnace yeah it should be a little bit better for us Uh, it might get a little bit glitchy here because if I'm getting too close to all that wood over there uh, The game doesn't like it. There's so many trees laying on the floor there Not uh, the most fun thing for the game to uh, handle Always getting a little bit uh, of stutter and that kind of stuff But that's not so strange. I think there might be three or four hundred trees laying uh, there So not quite the surprise uh, let's put this one in create a job uh, we could do with two headlands why not sharp clockwise I think we are okay manual 90 degrees now let's try automatic uh, it does do that okay and we are a little bit off Let's make a turn here, that might be a little bit easier, instead of uh, trying to go back and forward. Let's do it like this. And then let's tell it that it needs to pick up the first waypoint, we can pick up the blue one, that's a little bit better. 21 minutes, okay. But you are at least uh, taking care of the weeds here. So basically we have uh, four tractors running at the moment. And I'm going to leave it at this people. I'd like to thank you all for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already done so. And hopefully until the next time. Bye for now.